Drives one to right field, cutting across his Nimmo, and he makes a beautiful grab. Brandon Nimmo just back from the disabled list, and he turned on the Jets to take an extra base in away from Murphy for the first down. And he strikes out Baez on three pitches, the last one at 100. Have we ever seen 100 from DeGrom before? I don't think so. We're a home run off Max Scherzer, 1 0 in the fourth. Hit over the bag, and a great stop by Bruce, and he hits DeGrom on the move. Second fantastic defensive play made by the Mets behind DeGrom. First Nimmo, and now Bruce laying out to take an extra base hit away from Caratini. On the outside corner, and Schwarber is caught looking. The 0 2. Check swing. Did he go around? They look to first. Strike three, says Stu Shearwater. Motion on the mound. The 2 2 coming. Hamill swings and misses. Down he goes. That one at a near 98. 2 2, two out pitch. Wave and a miss. Down goes Murphy. 99 to get him. And he gets the slider over for strike three call. Every pitch is under duress. Back to DeGrabo. Snags it beautifully. There's a gold glove in his future. Rob slots one toward the hole. Baez has no play, and the Mets have the first run of the game. How about that? Using Jeff McNeil's bat, DeGrom has his second infield hit of the night. Frazier scores the first run of the game, and it's 1 0 New York, and it's DeGrom who drives it in. Beat Syndergaard, but they beat the Mets last night. That's past Bruce into right, and Elmore will make it to third. Best scoring chance of the night for the Cubs. How good is Ben Zobrist? Answer, really good. Channing Bodie, Bodie. High drive to center. Rosario back on it. This should tie it. He makes the catch. Zobrist tags. He'll hold it first. Almora scores. One to one. David Bodie. With a sacrifice fly. Yeah, I like the approach. Go early there. A smart approach, middle of the diamond, try to get the ball airborne. Struck him out. DeGrom runs the slaughter in on Murphy. He gets the big strikeout to keep the game tied. One two to Baez. Struck him out. Number 10 for DeGrom. Now the 2-2. Two -two. Ground ball. DeGrom's got it. Rosario on to first. Double play. Side retired. Jacob DeGrom unrelentingly brilliant. There is lightning in the area, and they have announced now on the scoreboard, as you see, they want the fans to seek shelter. It's not just the rain. We might end up finishing this game tomorrow. Left to right as we get started. Runner goes. Called strike three. The throw. In time. They got him. Strike him out, throw him out, double play. One two to Bodie, and the curveball, he loses the bat and he strikes out. That winds up in the camera well, and Bodie is down on strikes to start the bottom of the tenth. And here it is. Line caught over his double play. Nimmo off the bag. So a strike him out, throw him out in the tenth. A line out, throw him out in the eleventh. Holds on the runner. Martini bunts. It's a good one. So throws it away. It's off the tarp. Bias to third. Big turn. He's going to hold there. Cubs have runners at second and third with nobody out. Oh my! Boy, that was fun to watch because you know, had Bias. Picked it up earlier that that throw was there. Outfield in. Ground ball up the middle. Cubs win. Cubs win. Baez scores on the Zobrist single. Two on the final. So calm under pressure. Doesn't let the moment get to him. They only needed one hit in the 11th. Now Zo gets another breaking ball away. Three in a row. And he just shoots this ball right back through the middle. Very professional at bat. Nothing were nothing unusual about that with Zoe at the plate, and he ends this ball game with a knock, and the Cubs win. And for the first time since last September, the Cubs have won seven straight games. They're heating up.